Pothier, a renowned French jurist, made significant contributions to the field of law through his numerous works. One of his most notable publications is the Book on the Law of Obligations, which was posthumously released. This book delves into the intricate aspects of legal obligations, providing valuable insights for legal scholars and practitioners. Pothier's meticulous research and analysis are evident in this comprehensive work, making it a valuable resource for anyone interested in the study of law. Aside from his work on the law of obligations, Pothier also penned a book on the loan contract. This publication explores the complexities of loan agreements, shedding light on the various legal considerations that come into play. Pothier's expertise in this area is evident in his thorough examination of the subject matter, making the book a seminal work in the field of contract law. Legal scholars and professionals can benefit greatly from the insights offered in this comprehensive publication. In addition to his contributions to the study of loan contracts, Pothier also delved into the realm of bottom reloans in his 1777 publication. This work addresses the intricacies of bottom reloans, offering a comprehensive analysis of the legal principles and considerations involved. Pothier's expertise in this area is evident in his meticulous examination of the subject matter, making the book an invaluable resource for those interested in maritime law and related fields. While Pothier is widely recognized for his works on the law of obligations and contracts, he also made significant contributions to the study of family law and persons. In 1768, he authored a book specifically focusing on persons and the marriage contract. This publication delves into the legal aspects of personal relationships and marriage contracts, offering valuable insights into the legal frameworks governing these areas. Pothier's expertise in family law is evident in this seminal work, making it a valuable resource for scholars and practitioners alike.